Today at Merlin Machinery, we have a Hardinge HLVH Super Precision Serial number 10180 I believe that's a 1982 It's all original paint It's got a Buck Adjust True 6 jaw chuck on it A KDK Low Profile Tool Post with five holders, the Jacobs ball bearing super chuck. It's one of the smaller ones. I believe that's a three eighth capacity. In the cabinet, you have the spindle nose protector down there. You have the uh, coolant nozzle. Here you have two live centers, even though this one I believe is tight. The other one spins and some collets. Some more collets. It's a little, little discoloration on the paint up here. I don't know what happened where or what that is. The ways seem pretty good. The way wipers are not bad. The lighting is not the best in here today, but new all two axis digital readout. It's wired for 230 volt, three phase. This one, they set the scale up coming off the back of the compound, so it's not jamming up with chips on the side of the compound. Has the built-in coolant pump. We have, because the chuck is on it at the moment, there is no collet in the machine, so the drawbar might make a little noise, but we will run it for you. Digital readout works fine. First, it's low speed. That's at a thousand RPM. There's 125. We got high speed. All the way up to 3,000. Rattle with the set cover. that on. Let's see. There's a carriage feeding toward the tailstock. Carriage feeding toward the head. Speed it up. Slow it down. On a fast speed. Slow it down. Digital readout counting. Now we'll do the cross feed. Go the other direction with the cross feed. And we can put it in slow speed. Let's put the engage the threading first. I gotta put the camera down to, th to engage that. I don't have it by myself today, so bear with me. Okay. So now we got the threading. There's the let's engage the half nut. Let's shoot. There you go, it's feeding away. Now we flick the lever feeding back. It's 
a halfway decent machine. Everything's smooth on it. There's no binding of the carriage anywhere. It turns nice and smooth. Cross feed is smooth. So is so the compound. These HLVHs are getting a little hard to find. So check this machine out and more on our website, mullinmachinery.com. That's M-U-L-L-I-N machinery.com for all your tool room and fabricating needs.